Shot MR, it talks about all the holidays and how we are supposed to celebrate them. First, it talks about Shabbat and then the holidays that only come once a year. In the Torah, the first month is Nisan, so the Parsha starts with Pesach, and then teaches us about Shavuot, Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur, Sukkot, and Shemini Atzeret. All of a sudden, the Torah starts talking about the menorah and the Shulchan in the Mishkan. Why does the Torah start talking about this? It seems irrelevant to the subjects of holidays, and we already learned about the Mishkan in Sefer Shemot. We know that there are two holidays that are Dirabanan, established by the rabbis. Purim and Hanukkah were only celebrated after the miracles happened. They were not mentioned in the Torah Shebechtav. Our Chachamim teach us that the additional sections about the menorah and the Shulchan at the end of the, all the holidays was, are a hint that there would be two more holidays. The menorah is a hint to Hanukkah and the, mir, and the miracle of the oil lasting eight days. On Purim, we celebrate by having a mishteh. The Shulchan was literally bread on a table. It is a hint to that mitzvah. We see that Hashem has intended for the mitzvot that our rabbis established. How careful we must be to keep these mitzvot. Have an awesome and wonderful Shabbat.